once felt I'm done with the defense Throw back and climb over your fence Hide to show, show you that I was a mess So you were shrugging your shoulders I'm closed off, that's what I told ya Soon enough, everything started to change Cause there's no going back no going back, there's no going back to your own life Not living in the past, we're over that I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the dizzying high Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Jill and today I have a two day whole messy house clean with me plus Thanksgiving prep and cleanup. I had my work cut out for me this holiday. I was hosting and I wanted it that way just to keep myself busy after losing my mom. And I had about 10 to 15 people coming over plus kids. So I wanted to start on day one by organizing out all of the kids toys and crafts. I had them in this upper cabinet, some of the crafts, and I wanted to put it in an easy access space so that while the adults were doing stuff, the kids could just grab and go. And it worked out really well. And I'm going to keep it that way even for Maddie and my daughter in the future, just because it makes my life a little bit easier. I can just switch out the bins now, add some more things in there. I know I'll be getting a lot more for Christmas, so it's perfect that I had the extra space and I'm really glad that I did it. So I'm just starting, it's always deceiving what's in these drawers. Look at everything on this table. I actually had a friend bring over a cake, which was really nice because I don't bake and I really appreciated her doing that. It's the little things in friendship. So just getting all of the markers and craft items into some of these Dollar Tree bins. I need to pick up a few more, but it was a good start and the kids had so much fun with it. I also had my Keurig break on me this morning. Like I can't even you guys with the chaos of the holidays, uh, mama needed her coffee. So You'll see in just a minute, I decided to take a quick Target um, run and just got the pickup. And luckily they had only one Keurig left, so I got that. And of course, being me, I can't just get one thing at Target. So I have a little mini haul in here. So after we get some of this organizing done, I showed you guys what I got from Target and then moved on to some of the deep cleaning of the oven and more of my drawers and cabinets that just had spills and little handprints everywhere. So I hope that you all had an awesome Thanksgiving. On day two of this, I went through just us cooking a little bit, having fun with it, and of course, cleaning up after. Hello, how'd you do? I'm not broken, I'm just split in two. Hope you're fine, ain't got time to do everything you said you would frames of the past and the memory of you just come running by pictures of sunny days with your smile and the bar how could they say i was broken how could they say you made me come undone now i know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them oh. How could they say I was broken? How could they say you made me come undone? Now I know that it's okay Unlike my friends, you are nothing like them So just showing you the before shot of my oven, it honestly wasn't that bad, but 
I needed to get it taken care of because I absolutely hate the smell of anything burnt while it's cooking for a long time. So I picked up this method to greaser. It was one of the things I got from Target. And I have to say it works really well and has a really natural scent to it, which I really appreciate instead of using harsh chemicals. Anytime I don't have to use harsh chemicals, I just prefer it if, I, if possible. But it is very watery, so you definitely need to rinse it out really good after. But to me, it was worth it and something I would definitely really recommend. And I definitely didn't have any of the burnt smell after, so it was definitely a win. I'm just trying to get by. I don't know how you do it. Trying to keep you up my mind. So this is the new Keurig. It's really pretty. I'm so glad I got it. It's in the white color because I want to go towards that theme more anyways. But yeah, this thing works amazing and it made me realize just how old my other one was. It took forever to brew. So I was just so happy to pick this up. I already need to clean it because the second I came home, I made one immediately. I might make another one in a second. <laughs> So I just wanted to show you guys really quickly what I got from Target. Look at this little unicorn beanie hat for winter. It's super soft and fleece. This was too cute. I had to get this. It came with matchy mittens, but I had those in the wash. They Target had the cutest pajama sets and little fleece sweaters, or I guess this would be called Sherpa. It, it, they are so nice, you guys, and everything was only $10 each, which I thought was a pretty good deal, but... These are almost, these pajamas for winter, I mean, are you kidding me? Look how cute with the little polar bears and the little reindeer and the trees. I, I, they're like a velvet. I wish they made these in my size, but I picked up two of these for her and she really loves them and sleeps really well in them. They're like warm, but not too, they're like, they're nice and cozy, but not too warm, you know? So I got two of these. This one has like the snowman on it. I want to go back and pick up a few more because they... She likes even wearing them during the day and stuff sometimes too. And then Maddie really loves rainbows, so I got two of these Sherpas. I really thought these were so cute, you guys, for $10. I feel like you can't beat it with Target sometimes. But I just, I love this for like the cooler weather. You can just throw this on super quick, go outside if you're just running, you know, into the car. And, or for like when I'm taking her to gymnastics even, and I got her the little heart one as well. They had so many, but they were selling out super fast. So 
if you are looking for something like that, I would recommend doing it quickly. But I got the rainbows because she really loves them. I got her a few of these like little fleece pants that have the sparkles on them. And then I got myself this little stand. I've been wanting one to put like my soap products and sponges and stuff like that on it. So I also picked up some of the, um, the Mrs. Myers in the snowdrop scent. I absolutely love this scent. It is so almost refreshing and I need to find the multi-purpose cleaner because they were all sold out of it, but I'm sure it'll be back soon. And then lastly, I got these books. Look how big these are, you guys. They had about five different sets of them. I picked up three. These are just two of them here. She absolutely loves this polar bear one. It is so cute. They're all, a lot of them at least were Christmas themed, but I thought these were such nice quality and for like a really large book. Maddie absolutely adores these and she always asks for the polar bear book now. And, and they're only $5, so I'm going to pick up the whole set, but I just wanted to show you guys that if you were looking for something cute to get for Christmas that, you know, you can read to them at night without breaking the bank. So I need to start getting organized and I think I'm going to start on the dishes and move on to organizing the drawers. morning you guys I'm actually outside right now because all of the kids um, are starting to come and it's like chaos and a zoo in there and I can't really speak <laughs> but happy Thanksgiving you guys look at all of these leaves so after Thanksgiving we are definitely gonna have our work cut out for us but it is about 10 a.m. I'm gonna just start cooking now getting a bit windy out here but actually it feels good because you know when you're cooking in the kitchen and it's so warm we have just a feast we're making I have a bunch of people coming over thankfully I don't have to bake anything though it's not my thing and I store bought all of the desserts so I'm gonna get started probably right now um, John's working on the turkey God bless my wife <laughs> just kidding but seriously it pays to have a man who cooks. It de-stresses me a lot. <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna start the crock pot southern mac and cheese, the green bean casserole, probably start something with the cranberries and just get like the drinks and stuff prepared. Just get some like appetizer foods out for everybody. So I'm excited to get cooking and happy Thanksgiving to you guys. Put 
Moving on to a few hours later in the evening, I am showing you this hot mess left over. It doesn't even do it justice. I had so much cleanup upstairs outside, but I wanted to at least get the kitchen and the living room cleaned up while the kids were occupied outside for a little bit and the guys were watching football. It was worth it to me so that way we could just have some desserts after and the kitchen wouldn't be such a mess. So just starting to put the leftovers away, get this massive amount of dishes done and hopefully get to enjoy a little bit of the game myself. <music> you could see yourself just sitting there on my chair I'm staring at you you don't even notice should have told you straight away you don't have to be afraid anymore I know you haven't noticed you know you
so I was just trying to finish tackling these dishes, at least get a load started. I knew that I wouldn't be able to fit it all in one load, but is it Thanksgiving if you can even fill your dishwasher just once? So just getting that started, getting some of the dishes soaking so that it'd be for easy cleanup later on when everybody finally left. And then I just moved on to cleaning up my living room. I just wanted to clean up some of the toys. I just had one or the two kids staying um, a little bit later for some desserts and to watch a movie. So I just wanted to pick up a lot of the blocks and messes that they made in there. Just get the blankets and pillows organized and vacuum up so that we could sit and drink hot chocolate and just be cozy and enjoy the night. How come the stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away show us where we are what makes the sun go to sleep every night and what's it dreaming of i wonder how come the sky sometimes hides behind the clouds maybe it's just like me a little bit scared of heights why does the rain always keep on pouring down when it's gray outside? It really makes me wonder. Yeah, it makes me wonder. It really makes me wonder. What wonder? Where we are It really makes me wonder 